Urshela powers that to left field and deep. That ball is gone. Gio Urshela just keeps raking. It's 2-0 Yankees. We talked about the way he impacts the baseball. There it is again. Panone trying to come in on 0-2, does not get it in there. And Gio, that's not choking up and with two strikes going to right. That's still swinging the bat with a. Another 3-2. Swung on and missed. Got him with the curve. And Herman retires three. That one gets through McGuire. Coming home to score is Valera. And on to third goes LeMayu. It's three. 2-0. That ball is hit deep to left field. He's done it again. Gio Urshela with a bomb to left. Back-to-back -back multi home run games, and it's five nothing Yankees. I think two two to Maven is lined into center field, a base hit. Gregorius rounding third, he will score. It's an RBI single for Cameron Maven. And the Yankees' lead is 6 nothing. That ball is hit in the air to right field and deep. Back is Gritchick. Looking up, he has another. The talk man goes yard. His 11th. And it's 8 nothing Bombers. which is not the ideal situation, but there's no land in Dunedin to move them. This ball is drilled deep right, and Derek Fisher has homered in his second consecutive game. Well, the power is there. We have talked about that with Fisher. He had an opposite field home run off the left-handed pitcher yesterday. Guriel and a base hit into left center. Vigio had to break back to the bag. He is still getting the wave. The relay throw to the plate. Not in time. LeMayhew lines that to right center field. A base hit. Ford will score. Here comes Valera. He will score. Two more tack on runs for the Bombers as LeMayhew has a three hit night. It's 10 4 Yankees. It's much more effectively with more work as Tonkman shoots that to left field, a base hit. Urshela scores. Maven heading home. He will score. Tonkman takes second on the throw. It's a two run single for Mike Tonkman. And the Yankees' lead is 12 6.